Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use Fit and Fill in Final Cut Pro. Have you got footage looking like this, which is not covering the full frame because you've got black bars left and right? Well, I'm going to show you how to fix that. And you see, currently it's set to fit. So that is the best possible result. You can enlarge it, but they won't export like that. This is how it's going to export to, you see. Make sure the clip is selected and go to this little box here and then go to this tab and scroll down and look for type here. It's currently set to fit. You want it to fill, okay? And you see now it covers the frame. So it will be exported like this if left in that state, okay? The other issue is if you have different clips all chopped up, then you're doing this to every single one. It's going to take a lot of time. So what you can do, another tip, I'll just put this back for now. So we put it back to fit. Okay. What we need to do is we'll see all our clips. Make sure you highlight them all so you can either drag or you can press command A. Command D is a better way because you just make sure you select everything on your timeline. Once you're happy, it's all highlighted yellow. Just do what I did last time. Go to here and press fill. Okay. You see now every clip all in one foul swoop is in full screen. It's much better than leaving blank space when people are watching YouTube, isn't it? Also another point is, of course, you can just zoom in, zoom in, zoom out with the scale here, transform tools. You can zoom in, zoom out. You can do it manually as well. You don't have to, you know, use the, the fit and fill. Um, you can do it like this, but this will take more time. Yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I hope that helps you. See you next time. Peace.